Hi, Muffins. It's day 14. Um, today was good, fine. Um, I woke up feeling much better, more solid, and I felt good. After I wrote that list last night, there was no way recovery wasn't the thing I was going to do. I mean, that list was crazy, right? Sometimes I'm an asshole, but I'm not that much of an asshole. <laughs> that I could write a list like that and be like, oh, I'm going to stay active in my eating disorder. No way. Um, seems like a no-brainer, probably, but it took me a little while. I wanted it to be real when I got to this point, and it is. I choose me. I choose me. Yay. So, all day I've been like, all day I've been feeling the effects of choosing me. And it's fun. Feels good. Um, this morning, I had to drive the kids to 30th Street and we got there a bit early, so I was going to be like 20 to 25 minutes early for treatment. So I decided, and I have my camera, thank goodness, with me, my real camera. I usually do, um, but I almost didn't bring it today. But I was like, oh, let me get it. So I got it. Um, I was driving and I was shooting. And then I was late. <laughs> I ended up being like two minutes late. Because I was shooting so much, and I went into neighborhoods that probably was not the best idea for me to go into by myself, but um, whatever I did, and I'm still here. Um, that was the weapon reference, Sarah. Um, I need one. <laughs> Something. Or I need, like, Krav Maga class, some kind of self-defense thing, so at least I can fight if needed. Um... I did not have to today, but just thinking ahead. So it was a lot of fun, and I came across some really dope stuff. And I was just, it was so fun driving. And every time I see stuff, I'm like, ah! I get really excited. And then it's like an adrenaline rush, and it's just fun. Um, so there, there was that. That was my ride in. It was very fun. And Jimmy was totally fine. Meals were fine, ate 100%, didn't have a problem with them. Um, one of the girls made me a really fun sign. I'm going to hold it up even though it's backward to you, but here you go. Leave me the fuck alone, Ed. Ed is what we call our eating disorder. Get it? Ed. Thank you, baby girl. I'm not going to shout out your name, but you know who you are. Thank you. So we did this other thing in relapse prevention group um, where we had like a picture that represented Ed on one side of the room and then like a picture that represented recovery on the other side and the therapist gave us these blank pieces of like rectangular paper to be bricks and so we wrote things that were obstacles or roadblocks from Ed to recovery and then we gave them to the therapist and then she laid them out like a road from Ed to recovery. And then we walked across them, and we had to read the ones we stepped on, and that was interesting. And then we had to place ourselves on the road, and I was closer to recovery than further, so that, you know, it's accurate. Um, then, and this is the part I thought was most interesting and definitely helpful, we had to go through and pick up the words that we have either already worked through or are currently working through. And that was very interesting. They didn't have to be our own words. I, I wrote four word, four things. Um, and I think I picked up three of mine. I forgot what one I didn't pick up. That's interesting, right? I don't remember. Um, I'm going to read some of them. I'm not going to read all of them because... I'm... I'm being, I don't know, I'm just 
there's just one. I'm not going to read that one. Um, it was important, but yeah. Okay. Anyway, so these are things that this is one that I'm work through and we'll still need to work through once I put weight back on when I'm eating 100% of my meal plan. Um, it's inability to sit with feelings, um, which means like when you're feeling something, you can't just sit with it. You have to like try to do something to distract yourself. And I pretty much work through that. And I know I'm going to need to do more work on that. This one, need for control. Vulnerability. The need for control was mine, by the way. Um, this was mine, too. Obsessive thoughts. Worked through that. Still working through some of it, but yeah. They're the worst. Failed before, failed before, why will this be different? Working through, work through, because I know it'll be different. Remembering why I want to change. Work through, finally, <laughs> took me long enough. Feeling alone. Working through, I mostly work through, but I'm, um, yeah. Non-acceptance of self, that is work in progress. This is the one I'm not reading out loud. I'm not even going to show you what it says. It doesn't have to do with me. That's why I'm not showing it, and I didn't write it. Someone else did, and they didn't pick it up because they're still working through that. I picked it up because I worked through that one. Okay, um, fear of change, worked through. I'm sure that'll come back up. This one is work in progress, depression. This one is a work in progress, but yeah, it's a work in progress. Lack of self-love. It's higher than it was. This one, hopeless. I do not feel hopeless anymore. And this was mine. Irrational beliefs. Work through. Woo-hoo! Woo-hoo! Go deep! Go deep! Okay, so, yay. I thought that was interesting. Um... It's interesting to see what people picked up and stuff. I, I picked up the most. <laughs> there you go. So, I don't know. I'm on the road to recovery. And I know it's going to be hard in parts. The body image stuff is still the stuff that, I, like, still there. But I know I can get through it. And I'm glad that I'm... Getting, going, going to be getting through it while in therapy. So I will have good and proper support when that starts happening. Um, people were texting me and asking me if I have weekend plans. I don't have anything solid, and you know what? I'm happy about that. I'm just going with the flow, and choosing me. So, yay. All right. I hope everybody's Friday night is fun and happy and safe. And I hope your weekend is fantastic. And I may or may not update again through the weekend. Um, maybe. We'll see. Um, but if I don't, I'll be back on Monday for day 15. Yay. Okay. Bye, lovelies.